the manifesto of Whiskerino. We are alienated from our facial hair. Society tells us that full beards are unacceptable. Businessmen, politicians, bankers, and the like are all clean shaven. All demonstrating the standards that middle class society expects us to maintain. In other words, these are all examples of the man keeping down nascent beards everywhere. These are the people who alienate us from our masculinity, forcing us to shave and adopt public personas which might not reflect our true inner animal. But it wasn't always so. W-H-I-S-K-E-R-I-N-O dot O R G. Beards used to be glorified as signs of virility and manliness. A man that couldn't grow a strong beard was privately ridiculed. Some societies would only allow males to grow beards once they were married, thus denoting a sign of stature and respect in the community. To be shaved was to be emasculated. In early America, men that could not grow facial hair were demeaned, less advanced, and uncivilized. Now we've come full circle where our own society promotes this emasculated version of maleness. Where to be a man is to be clean shaved to be respectable is not to have a beard. Let us return to our roots. Let us return to true masculinity. Let us cry out with one voice. I will have a beard. I will be a man. I will not conform to your rules. <laughs>